This is Alin from Javelin and in this video I will show you how easy it is to apply the same material to all components of an assembly. It doesn't matter how many levels of uh, sub-assemblies you would have. Uh, if I'm uh, checking this specific assembly, looks like the depth is 5. So I have 5 levels of sub-assemblies nested in, uh, in this assembly. The question is how can I select all the components because if I'm trying to do this with a window um, and I'm trying to go to the material, the material will be a, will not work obviously because I'm selecting also assembly components, not only parts. So I have to find a way to filter only the parts. And uh, the answer lays right here under the advanced selection. I'm going to look for uh, the document name. The condition is that the text that I'm going to write right now should be part of the document name. And the best way to identify a part is to use its extension, which is SLDPRT. One thing that you can do with this uh, advanced selection, you can actually name the search. So let's say I'm going to call this select parts. So next time I don't have to go and do again all this work. I'm going to save this selection and if I go here to manage searches I'm going to add this to the favorites so you'll see right now how nice this works I'm going to advanced selection and I have a new option here select only the parts as you can see only the parts got selected if I ex expand the content of a sub-assembly you'll find out that the parts at the sub-assembly level actually got selected doesn't matter where they are in the tree in what sub-assembly they are so now the only thing I need to do is to right click on the empty space, go to the material and specify what material I want to apply to this part. So let's uh, make this uh, barbecue really, really expensive um, and uh, maybe we're going to make it out of uh, gold. So uh, for metals, pure gold and I'm going to apply this to all these parts. Takes a bit of time to go through all of them, but right now I have a barbecue made out of gold. And if you're curious how heavy such a barbecue is, I can tell you that it's about 800 kilograms. Thank you very much.